What's going on guys? Today we got another video. Today we're going to be going over my catch can on my Focus ST, why you should have one, and why you should frequently look at it. Um, the first reason you should have a catch can, or the overall reason you should have your catch can, is to stop harmful oil and vapor going back on top of the valves and clogging your valves. Um, sometimes carbon can even get wedged between the head and the the seal from the valve and it can cause leaks damage you could bend a valve you could even bend your spark plug in there if it gets kicked up under compression it, there's a lot of damage that it can cause from uh the vapors getting caramelized on top of the the valves so that's why it's very important to have a catch can so now i'm going to show you about 2500 miles of what my catch can looks like all the oil that uh, drains out of it um what you can do is i have a little line off mine and a little valve so i'm going to cut this bottle in half about probably right there and drain it this is the bottle i cut and on the focus st if you have the damon motorsports uh, catch can you can see that line right there and that's the line that is the drain line put a little rock in here So it doesn't move from the wind um, But what you could do is Focus Put that right there Move the can over And then boom, you're good Now the Damon Motorsports is mounted right up front right on my intake manifold right there so now what you want to look for is this little valve down here. That is your release valve and it'll basically drain everything that's in here. I'll go ahead and flip that. Look at all that. It's only from a couple thousand miles, maybe, maybe a thousand, but that all goes on top of your valves. So this is the oil after. There is quite a bit in there. Um, I also checked my oil. It's a good thing to check your oil too because I was about like half a quart low, which makes sense because look how much is blow buying and just going into the catch can. I had drained it before about a month ago and there was a little more than that. Um, so that makes sense. I also noticed that I am having some sort of leak right here. I don't know if this is the cam position sensors or what, but it is leaking down there too. It's leaking up here and going down there. So I'm gonna have to look into that. But yeah, this is why it's super important to check your catch cans. And this is saving your motor. Imagine if this didn't have it, this has 70,000 miles on it. So think about doing a catch can guys.